Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. in game here, and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to make your NPCs talk to you in your game, so you can have a conversation with your with your NPCs. So if you want to make it so that uh, players are needing help, then you have an NPC that they can go to and they can give them instructions. Alright, so let's get straight into the video. Okay, so you can use this for different things. You can you can use it for like a shop or a quest or something like that. So what I'm gonna do to get my NPCs, I'm just gonna insert a character. I'm just gonna insert this one. You can insert um, whatever character you like. So I just need to uh, unlock this character. Okay, then I can drag it around. Um, I'm, I'm just gonna uh, turn off the name tag thing so you can't see the the name on it. So to make the NPC talk you don't need any scripts at all. You just need to insert a a dialogue inside of the head. So you just scroll down to um, 3D interfaces when you click on the plus and then click on dialogue like this. And then you can just change it so like um, multiple players can use it at the same time or just one. So if it's like a, a big game where you have a lot of people needing help changes to multiple players just so that it's not like where you have to wait your turn. Um, conversation distance, so this is the amount of stubs away that you're able to talk to your NPC. Um, so I'm just going to leave it at that. So the initial prompt is going to be um, what do you, do you need help, help with? Like this. You can add a goodbye dialogue if you want to, um, but you don't have to. Okay, so you can change the purpose um, for whatever type of uh, dialogue you want. So for mine, it's going to be help, but you can change it to either quest or shop if you want to. And change the tone to um, friendly or enemy, depends on what you want to. But if I, if my players I want help, I'm going to want my NPC to be friendly with them. So once I've set up my dialogue, I just need to uh, click on the plus and then add in a dialogue choice and then type in the user dialogue, so it's going to be like, I do, don't know what to do, like this, and then the response dialogue is what the NPC is going to reply, uh, so uh, I don't know what to put, like, you do this and then just explain what you want them to do and then you can add multiple multiple uh, choices if you want so just duplicate in these and like this and then if you want the conversation to continue you just add in a dialogue into that so I'm just going to add some dialogues in here like that so the conversation is just going to keep on continuing. So let me just go into the game and test it out. Okay, just loading the game. So as you can see, um, there is a, a speech bubble with a question mark over the head. And if you click on it, it's going to uh, load up those options. So it says, what do you need help with? And then you just say, what well, I don't know what to do. And then you do this and then the conversation just keeps on continuing and you can add as many you can add as many dialogue choices as you like so if I just stop the game and wait for it to load like this you can add as many dialogue choices as you want and just change the user dialogue and the response dialogue to what your character to what your character wants to say so yeah that's gonna be the end of today's video so if this video helped anyone see more then make sure you like subscribe and turn the bell to be notified if you're out so yeah I'll see you in the next one Bye.